Hey, lock ladies. So today I have two styles right on time for Valentine's Day. I'm going to start off with hydrating my hair with my hydration mist from K Essentials and then following up with their oil. Um, I love both. So lightweight. So fragrancy. It smells so good. It smells like summertime. It'll leave you fine. Okay. <laughs> But then I did do a halo curl. So I've done the halo curl a 1,799 times. If you see her in law and say that you don't know how to do that halo curl, I'm going to have to just fly out to where you at and pop you. Because at this point, I had enough. But anyways, I did it the day before and I just slept on it, of course, like always. Um, prior to me taking my hair down, I did go ahead and set my uh, baby hairs. I don't care, y'all. I'm going to call them baby hairs. I'm going to call it whatever I want. And period. And, oh, oh, you really could just do that and go. So, I really missed three styles because that's style number one. No, I'm just <laughs> So, for the first style, I already posted on Instagram, but I didn't get deep into um, the how-tos on it. I wanted to do a swoop with it, but I was like kind of pressed for time so i couldn't get the swoop part so eventually i'm gonna go back and venture back to the test out and then add a little swoop whoop to it i may not do a tutorial but i will post a picture of it i just did a two strand flat twist going back um not all the way back just partial because i do want the, the hearts to sit up i secured it with a rubber band you just wrapped that rubber band like two or three times y'all already know i do not play no tight ponytails um and then kind of like pull at it on the side so it stands straight up Now, once you did a little space and you put that second rubber band, I find it's better to put your two fingers at the top of the loop and then just wrap it behind going to the back. So that that way, the hairs that are sticking out are at the back of the heart and not at the front of the heart or like on the side or nothing like that. Like it's like they're just going back. So it kind of give it like a little layer look. And then when you do that, you wrap it, wrap the rubber band around the heart like once or twice and not too many times because you still don't want a tight ponytail and then you just kind of adjust it and fix it to how you want it to look once you have it done and like kind of set if you have lock pieces sticking out you can two strand twist the heart before you twist it before you fold it down and that'll help too but i mean if it gives the the look of a heart people know what a heart is you ain't got to make it all perfect girl you know what this heart is you know you know what i was trying to do okay at this point and then repeat on the other end or on the other side and that's basically it
Okay, that was cute. But for this one, we're going to do a quick, cute style. This is, like, so easy to me. Um, All I did was do two ponytails, but I went ahead and did a full twist going into one of the ponytails. Uh, well, going into both ponytails, actually. You leave out the little side piece. If you got locks, we already know how crucial that little side piece is. A lot, I think it's probably one out of every five women that's like, no, you can put the side piece up. But for me, I'm the other four. Put this side piece down. Give me a little side shebang, shebang, shemuk, wang, okay? But you, anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Now for the bang, I did put a bobby pin like underneath, kind of over directed it and then slit the bobby pin and then flipped it back over so it could give it like a shorter, more layered look for my bang area. And it wasn't it's so that it's not looking so long. Um, you know, like give, just give it a little razzle, a little razzle to the dazzle. Good Lord. There, there we go. And then also I did go ahead and do like a bun look with it as well. So you can see like this is like kind of cute if we want like going bowling. And he want to see me looking all cute, fun, and flirty. And then I put it in a bun just in case we go out to eat. And I need to, like, make it look a little sexy. A little sexy. Okay, anyways. Well, I hope you guys enjoy both looks. Even if you don't go with these looks, I hope you look bomb for Valentine's Day. Not even for your significant other, but just for yourself. Like, we deserve it, period.